Tommy Taylor on familiar ground here. Picked out by Shields, and the drive looks like it's a well set one. That's one stand sideways. Platform established. Now they've got it going forward. Important they keep that momentum on. John Ross doing a really good job trying to disrupt, but he's being taken out of it now. Bailado has side. it. Look at the drive and the power and the organisation from Wasps. They'll get full value for this. Really capitalising on their extra man. And then it's at this point when John O'Ross is taken out of the equation that there's nothing they're going to be able to do. Look at all those blue shirts on that far side. Wasps just straight and go right through the middle. Really well set up try. And Dai Young be absolutely delighted. McIntyre. Sopoanga. Onwards from Gopper from the intercepts. Not at full stretch here, McGuigan, but great strength in the fans. And he's got the pass away as well. Here's Dupria inside his support if he needs it. He doesn't need it. A quality score from the Sail Sharks. And all down to the opportunism and the strength from Byron McGuigan, Dan Dupree finishes the job. That's a big tackle from Curry, putting Gopper under pressure. McGuigan's up high in the line, follows him, but how well does he do to skip out of these tackles, get the offload away? And then Dupree just the step back against the covering defence, wrong puts them. How well does he do? He can't get away fully. He just keeps the leg drive going, ties in two extra defenders, and Dan Dupree on his show. Immediately makes the step. McIntyre bundled. Strong work from Evans. Ross having to work very hard for every little spare patch of ground. Sopoanga might have worked something here. There's an overlap. Minotsi's off, and he's carving back against the grain, he's got support from De Jong, and here's Nizam Kar, he's isolated, he needs some assistance, here's Taylor, on the bounce to Kibarigi. Chips, chases, oh. scores! <laughs> Wonderful finish from Zach Kibarigi, seemingly not much on in front of him, that is execution at its best. Not on that way, they come back to this side, Good bit of interplay. Here's Amkar running that deep line. He gets it now, and then look at this step out, and then he runs across towards the support, away from the defence. Brilliant hands. And then how about this? Looks like Sale have covered it. Little chip over the top, and what a finish at pace from Kivarigi. Stands his man up, stops him still so he can't turn, uses momentum to spin round and race him back to the line. 90 seconds remaining. Dupree climbing the list. Papier. A dog wool. Rides the challenge. Did he have his leg yeah, raised in dangerous agree. fashion? Well, you can do what you want when you jump in for the ball. Time is off. Time is off, clearly. That's all right, but then to straighten. So, Stu, can I, I just tell you what I'm seeing? He goes up with a bent leg, no, and then right. he extends he his left end. leg after he's caught the ball. Would you agree? Listen to me. Listen to me. So, the initial action is fine. You've gone up bent legs. The problem is you've extended that leg thereafter, and it's made contact with the head. There is no what? other one's decision. To make. That's no laughing matter. He needs to leave the field, Paolo Adolfo, against his former club. And Dan Dupria, perhaps fittingly, carries it up one final time, our Gallagher Premiership Man of the Match. It's been hard fought tonight, and the Sharks have closed the deal very effectively. Scrappy at times, lacking in fluency. But no doubt about the hunger and the desire from Steve Diamond's men.
full time at the AJ Bell. Sale denying Wasps the losing bonus. Sharks 28, Wasps 18.